the World Meteorological Organization said that the rise in sea level over the past decade was double what it was in the 1990s. The volume of glacier snow in Switzerland dropped by more than one third in the past 20 years. The report highlights incredible floods in Pakistan this summer that killed more than 1,700 people and displaced 7.9 million. It also mentions the crippling four-year drought in East Africa that has led to more than 18 million people going hungry and record heat waves causing health concerns for people in Europe and China. Unfortunately, we have already lost this uh, melting of glaciers uh, game, which means that the sea level rise uh, is supposed to continue for the coming hundreds of years or even thousands of years. And some, some of the most recent uh, studies by NASA is demonstrating that there's a risk of, uh, of several meters of sea, sea level rise uh, by 2300. We have uh, started seeing also melting of the Antarctic sea ice, which wasn't the case uh, in the past. And uh, during the past uh, three years, uh, there has been a severe drop in the, in the Antarctic uh, sea ice uh, cover. And this heat wave, uh, which was hitting Europe, uh, uh, led to dramatic melting of the, of the alpine glaciers. Uh, and uh, and uh, there's uh, records since 2000 from the Swiss uh, glaciers. And, uh, and we have never seen such strong melting of annual uh, glacier. It was more than 6% drop uh, of, uh, of the uh, glacier mass.